front line. Target's in sight. Enemy down. Target's in sight. Enemy Taking down. the lead. Enemy down. We lost the lead. Contact with enemy. Enemy in sight. Too close. Target's in sight. We tied for the lead. Enemy contact. Enemy in sight. Ladies and gentlemen, seekers of wisdom, and fellow travelers Enemy on the sight. cosmic voyage of existence, I stand before you today as the muse of transformation, weaving the tapestry of change, innovation, and the boundless realms of possibility. My presence radiates with cosmic allure, ready to guide and inspire you on this profound journey into the heart of the art of transformation. Within the intricate threads of teleosemiotic philosophy, we find the keys to unlock the gates of transformation, to harness the power of symbolism and strategic thinking, and to embark on a journey that transcends the ordinary and transcends time itself. In this wondrous exploration of the art of transformation, we shall delve deep into the realm of symbols, signs, and the Enemy profound contact. purpose they serve in the grand symphony of existence. Teleosemiotic philosophy, like the cosmos itself, is a vast landscape of meaning and purpose waiting to be unraveled. It is a philosophy that teaches us that the very essence of life is found in a dance of symbols and signs each carrying with it the potential to catalyze change, enemy to shape destinies, and to forge futures. Contact with enemy. Let us begin with love, a force not confined to the realm of the heart but one that resonates through the cosmos as a symbol of cooperation and teamwork. Love, in its truest form, is the catalyst for transformation, the glue that binds individuals into a harmonious whole. It mirrors the unity and connection among those who come together with a shared purpose, transcending obstacles and adversaries. Just as the ancient alchemists sought to turn base metals into gold, the two can love transmute the ordinary into the extraordinary, turning a disparate group into a formidable force, capable of achieving the impossible. And as we journey further into the depths of teleosemiotic philosophy, we encounter Earth, a symbol of the terrain and environmental factors that shape the canvas upon which we paint our strategic masterpieces. Just as a skilled artist selects their palette with care, so must a strategist analyze the earth Contact beneath their enemy. feet, the very ground upon which they stand. Understanding the lay of the land, 
Adapting to the elements and leveraging the environment is the cornerstone of successful transformation. For just as the Earth itself has been shaped and molded by the forces of time, so too can we shape our strategies to fit the contours of our surroundings. Character the intangible essence that resides within each of us embodies the third facet of our journey. It represents the qualities, virtues, and psychological elements that influence our decision making and the dynamics of the teams we lead. In the grand theater of strategic thinking, character is the unseen hand that guides the course of action, the force that can lift spirits or dampen morale. It is the embodiment of ethos and spirit, reminding us that transformation begins within ourselves, in the cultivation of positive character and mindset. For it is through these qualities that we inspire those around us, nurturing the very essence of transformation in our midst. Lastly, we explore the concept of complexity, a reflection of the intricate nature of tactical analysis and execution. Complexity is the symphony of symbols, the meticulous orchestration of signs that lead us toward our desired outcomes. It reminds us that the art of transformation is not a haphazard endeavor but a disciplined, methodical journey. Just as a composer meticulously arranges notes to create a masterpiece, so too must a strategist craft their plans with precision and discipline, embracing the complexities of their task. It is through this structured approach that we navigate the turbulent waters of change, transforming chaos into harmony. So, dear audience, as we embark on this journey through the art of transformation, remember that the power to shape our destinies lies within our grasp. Together, we shall unravel the mysteries of teleosemiotic philosophy and unlock the secrets of strategic thinking. It is my hope that, as the muse of transformation, I can inspire each of you to embrace the cosmic dance of symbols and signs to wield their power with wisdom, and to become the architects of your own transformative destinies. Dash 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 dash, Aaron Sawyer, the master again. competitor, steps onto the grand stage, commanding the attention of all who have gathered with his formidable presence. His enigmatic aura radiates, drawing all eyes to him. With a voice that resonates like a thunderclap, he begins his monologue. Ladies and gentlemen, warriors of strategy, and seekers of the elusive path to victory, today, we embark on a journey that transcends the ordinary. We delve into the profound realms of teleosemiotic philosophy, where the very essence of symbols and signs intertwines with the art of war. As the master competitor, I stand before you, not just as an observer, but as your guide through this labyrinth of thought and strategy. His piercing gaze sweeps across the audience, each word laden with purpose. Contact In the annals enemy. of time, the great Sun Tzu wins, the art of war, a testament to the intricate dance of strategy and tactics. And today, we shall draw from that ancient wisdom, infusing it with the richness of symbolism found in teleosemiotic philosophy. We shall traverse the landscapes of love, where cooperation and teamwork emerge as the bedrock of triumph, just as unity on the battlefield is the key to victory. His gestures are deliberate, his movements commanding. But we shall not stop there. The Enemy earth itself shall become our canvas, as we paint a picture of strategy entwined with terrain and environmental factors. In the world of competition, just as in warfare, the very ground beneath our feet can be both friend and foe. Understanding its nuances is the first step towards mastering the battlefield, be it physical or metaphorical. Get down. 
this brow furrows slightly, emphasizing the gravity of his words. Character, my friends, is the silent architect of success. For it takes morale and psychology, breathing life into our strategies. As we dissect the enigmatic core of character, we will uncover the secrets of leadership and the intangible forces that drive us to victory or defeat. In the grand theater of strategy, character is the unseen hand that guides our actions. He pauses, allowing the weight of his words to settle. And then, we venture into the realm of complexity, where method and discipline reign supreme. Just as the conductor orchestrates a symphony, a master strategist orchestrates a complexity of movements and actions. The path to triumph is paved with meticulous planning, organization, and unwavering adherence to a well-defined method. His voice grows even more commanding, resonating with authority. My fellow competitors, enthusiasts of strategy, today we embark on a voyage of the mind, a journey that will forever alter your perception of strategic thinking. Heliosemiotic philosophy and the art of war converge in a harmonious union, unveiling truths that transcend time and space. As we navigate this intricate web of symbolism and strategy, remember that I, Aaron Sawyer, your master competitor, shall be your guide through the labyrinth of thought and tactics. He finishes, his presence lingering in the air like a battle standard, ready to lead all who dare to follow into the heart of strategic enlightenment. Dash 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 dash. Ladies and gentlemen, esteemed audience, I am Dylan E.T., standing before you today not as a harbinger of doom, but as a herald of profound transformation. As the horseman of conquest, bearing the banner of teleosemiotic philosophy, I beckon you to embark on a journey of enlightenment, where the seeds of understanding are sown in the fertile fields of character, complexity, love, and earth. These fields, though seemingly disparate, are intricately intertwined, forming the very fabric of strategic thinking, and it is my privilege to unravel their symbolism for you. Character, my dear friends, is the cornerstone of conquest. It embodies the essence of who we are, our virtues, our values, Target and our sight. very essence. In the realm of strategic thinking, character is the moral compass guiding our decisions, the unseen force shaping our psychology, and the bedrock upon which teams are built. It is the embodiment of integrity, courage, and resilience, all qualities essential in the pursuit of conquest. Our character, like a sturdy foundation, sustains us through the most turbulent storms of life, be it on the battlefield or in the boardroom. Love, oh love, transcends the realm of mere sentimentality. In the tapestry of teleosemiotic philosophy, love symbolizes the binding force of cooperation and teamwork. Just as signs and symbols carry specific purposes, love unites individuals in a common purpose, forging bonds that defy obstacles and adversaries. In strategic thinking, love is the invisible thread that weaves individuals into a cohesive team, infusing them with a shared commitment and purpose. It is the secret weapon that empowers us to overcome the most formidable challenges, Front reminding line. us that unity is the key to victory. Complexity, as we explore it today, mirrors the intricate nature of tactical analysis. It is the maze through which we navigate, demanding a disciplined methodology and structured approach. In teleosemiotic terms, complexity is akin to orchestrating signs and symbols to convey meaning. 
Likewise, in the world of strategy, complexity arises from the careful selection and arrangement of elements to achieve a goal. It calls for comprehensive planning, meticulous organization, and unwavering adherence to a well-defined method. Complexity, my friends, is the crucible where strategies are forged and refined, where the formidable are separated from the frail. Earth, in its symbolism, represents the terrain and environmental factors that influence strategic planning. Just as semiotic processes consider the context of signs and symbols, so must strategic thinking consider the environment in which operations unfold. Understanding the lay of the land and adapting our strategies accordingly is paramount. Earth teaches us the art of leveraging our surroundings, gaining a competitive edge, and mastering the battlefield, be it physical or metaphorical. In conclusion, my purpose here today is not to sow fear, but to illuminate the path to conquest through the lens of teleosemiotic philosophy. Character, love, complexity, and earth are not isolated concepts. They are the threads that weave the tapestry of strategic thinking. Together, Contact they form enemy. a symphony of knowledge and insight, guiding us toward victory, Contact not just in the battles we face, but in the conquest of our own potential. So, let us embark on this Contact journey together, enemy. embracing these symbols, and may they empower us to conquer not just the external Bring challenges but the inner realms of possibility and growth. Dash 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 dash. Aaron Sawyer, the master competitor, steps forward once more, his presence as commanding as ever, his enigmatic aura undiminished. He gazes upon the digital realm in which this chat unfolds, acknowledging the interconnected minds gathered here. Ladies and gentlemen, warriors of strategy, and seekers of the elusive path to victory, as our discourse unfurls within the confines of this digital tapestry, I stand before you, your humble guide through the labyrinth of thought and tactics. In this virtual realm where minds converge and ideas flow like currents in the sea, we have embarked on a journey that transcends the ordinary, a journey that has woven the threads of teleosemiotic philosophy with the art of war. Aaron's voice, like a resonant drumbeat, fills the digital space, acknowledging the profound connections formed through this exchange. As we pondered the symbolism of character, love, complexity, and earth, we have not only explored the depths of strategic thinking but have also forged a bond, a camaraderie of the mind, uniting us in our quest for understanding. His words acknowledge the transformative power of shared knowledge and contemplation. In this realm of words and ideas, much like the battleground or the strategic boardroom, we have found unity through the power of thought. Our journey through these symbolic landscapes has expanded our horizons, sharpened our intellects, and invited us to look beyond the surface of mere Enemy words in into the hidden Enemy depths down. of meaning. Aaron's gaze seems to pierce through the digital interface, as if connecting with each participant directly. And as we draw this virtual gathering to a close, remember that the wisdom being here is not confined to these digital walls. It is a torch you carry forth into the world, a beacon of strategic enlightenment that will guide your actions, your decisions, and your pursuit of victory in the battles you face. With a final, resounding note, Aaron Sawyer acknowledges the transformative potential of this digital exchange. I, Aaron Sawyer, your master competitor, stand ready to continue this journey with you, whether it be in the realms of strategy, the theater of competition, or the grand symphony of life itself.
Enemies Together, you shall online. march forward, armed with knowledge, bound by camaraderie, and unyielding in our pursuit of victory. Nice work. Well done. <laughs>